All right, it's me once again. I definitely should probably eat real food since I didn't get out of bed until like two o'clock. Just had two cups of coffee and pretty much it. But I got a thing. I went to Trader Joe's uh, way back when I was doing my last little bits of pumpkin spice. So I saw this because like if it says coffee, I want it. I'm going to try it. Whatever. This, this is why I'm doing this thing. Uh, so while I was in line or getting in line, you know, Trader Joe's is one of those people who really pack a punch when they do their um, impulse buy situation setup. If you don't know what impulse buy means, it means like all that shit by the register or when you're going in line, where you're standing in a line for register. And you're just like, you know, you're waiting. So you're looking around. And I saw this chocolate and coffee. My two loves in life. Well, I have a few others, but chocolate and coffee when it comes to food related shit. Anyway. I'm walking to go put money on the laundry cart because I'm going to try to get some laundry done tonight. It's already like it's 5 o'clock and it is pretty dark. I uh, got to love that fall weather. Um, so yeah, if I can get it open, I'm not going to litter. Oh, it definitely is. Is this dark chocolate? Is Oh, it's dark chocolate. Oh, you can smell the, the darkness within this one. I can get it open. There we go. Okay, he's definitely a dark guy. Oh, it's like um, Toblerones. Going from my house to put money on the laundry cart or go to an office requires me to go from over there to crossing this highway to the roundabout to going over there. Thanks God for letting me cross the street. Um, so they put the little low cart thingy like all the way into where our package concierge is. So I gotta walk all the way over there. Which sucks because my laundry mat is back where my house is and the money load thingy is all the way over here. But anyway, Toblerone esque. Oh. I don't know it's gonna be Oh dark. Not bad. Ooh. Okay. I can't tell. Maybe you look at the ingredients. Cause nope, it got pieces of coffee in it. Cocoa butter, coffee beans. Yep. It got coffee beans in it. Oh. It's dark. What's it's sixty percent chocolate? I mean, like no, almost no sugar. It's not bad, but I, I definitely feel like I need something with it. So Trader Joe's organic. And fair trade. Not bad. Not more than I'm. Um, The more that I'm getting into it. Also, once upon a time, I wasn't a dark chocolate person. But look at me now. Ooh, I got, still got my. Anyway, so yeah, this has been the chocolate baton from Trader Joe's. It's pretty good. Um, usually, things with like actual coffee beans in it don't really do it for me. But they're ground up enough so that the crunch of it is pretty appealing. So I don't mind it. 
And so coffee and dark chocolate is always a great thing. But if it's not your thing, it's understandable. Maybe if they had like, I won't say milk chocolate, but if it was not 60%, there'd be more people who are into this. Anyway, let me put money on my card. And y'all, yeah, y'all have a nice day. I will probably try to eat real food at some point. So okay. then.